Hello, this is Todd Luck with a Power Rangers discussion video. Happy New Year's, Ranger fans. 2019 will be a historic year for Power Rangers as we see its new owner, Hasbro, taking charge of the 25-year-old franchise. While a lot is still unknown at this point, there are six things we definitely know are happening this year. Number one, Power Rangers Beast Morphers will premiere in February. This series will adapt Go Busters and run for two seasons. It'll follow a team of rangers created by a secret agency that combined a new substance called Morphex with animal DNA. The rangers will find an evil computer virus named Evox that wants to take over the morphing grid. This will be a transitionary season that was initially conceived by Saban Brands and made by Hasbro, who is keeping a lot of key people in place who make the show and run the franchise, so fans can expect something consistent with the series but fresh at the same time. Number two, Beast Morpher toys coming this spring. Hasbro will take over the toy line in April, and unconfirmed listings show that they plan to continue to produce the same variety of figures, zords, and roleplay items we've come to expect from the line. We'll see if Hasbro can bring the same quality to Power Rangers that they've produced with lines like Transformers, Star Wars, and Marvel. Number three, the new Lightning Collection. These show accurate figures will feature interchangeable heads, weapons, and special effects, and most will retail for $19.99. So far, White Ranger is the only confirmed figure, but unconfirmed listings have Lord Zed, Mighty Morphin Pink Ranger, Dino Charge Red Ranger, Magna Defender, SPD Shadow Ranger, along with possible Beast Morpher Rangers in the line, so it looks like a good mix of popular characters. Number four, Power Rangers comics will continue from Boom Studios with both titles completing their first storylines after Shattered Grid. It's uncertain what comes after that, but with the success and good buzz behind the comics and the art Boom has been producing for other products in the franchise, there's a good chance the licensing agreement with Boom will continue, but we'll just have to wait and see. Number four, the Power Rangers Hero of the Grid tabletop game. After the colossally successful Kickstarter campaign, the game will launch with gorgeous artwork from Boom Studios and tons of highly detailed miniatures. If you're into that sort of thing, it doesn't get much better than this. Number six, Power Rangers mobile games will continue in 2019. With the success of Legacy Wars and the newness of Power Rangers All-Stars, we can expect both these games to continue into the new year. Hasbro has a history of having faithful, high-quality mobile games based on their current shows, so could we possibly see a Beast Morphers app added to the mix? I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what we get out of Hasbro in this arena. And that's pretty much everything we know for certain about 2019 so far. Obviously, there should be more announcements and reveals as the year goes on, so let me know in the comments below what you're looking forward to and what you'd like to see Hasbro do that hasn't been announced yet. Like and subscribe for more videos, and until next time, may the power protect you.